All right, everybody, so I'm gonna go around first off and take the trim pieces off on the side of the carbon fiber roof. To do that, you just kinda gotta get into the ends with a little bit of a plastic pry tool. If you can just lift up a little bit with a little bit of pressure and then just kinda wiggle back and forth, usually the clips will just kinda pop and then you can just slowly go along and do that and it'll come off. So shark fins off. Now the way you saw me doing that is not necessarily the best way to do it. Um, they do have piano wire that you can sit there or floss or whatever you want to use to cut through this double sided sticky tape. But, um, <clears throat> but that worked because I knew I'm stripping the carbon fiber roof. If I accidentally scratch it, not a huge deal because I'm taking all the clear coat off anyway. So I actually didn't scratch anything, taped around it. Um, used a you know razor blade and started to cut the tape and then you know very carefully wedged a plastic bone tool underneath and to create a little pressure continued to cut all the way around and then I used two bone tools to lift it even more finish cutting any leftover adhesive and then it just popped right off so now I just have to take the electronic part of it off and um, I'm gonna see what I can do about getting the leftover double-sided sticky tape off of there. And um, if I can't get it all off, I mean, I'd like to, because I want this to, to be a good, clear job. Um, and I'd like to go all the way underneath this trim piece. Uh, but I, I'm gonna do my best to get that off, and then I'm gonna start stripping the clear off of the, the roof itself. So, hang in there. So now I'm gonna go ahead and strip the clear off. Um, you'll see how I do it. Just a few minutes here.
little tripod here. So, not sure how long this is gonna take, but over on that side, the corner uh, is pretty, pretty strong. It won't blow off. So I'm having to carefully like chip it and then blow it and chip it and blow it. Not sure how long my memory card is gonna last. So I just wanna explain what I did. I put on a mask because when I was blowing it, there's lots of, from underneath the clear, a lot of dust and powder coming up. And I don't know if that's, you know, fine fragments of carbon or old clear coat or what it is, but either way, not good to breathe that stuff in. Um, just, you know, all I was trying to do was force the air under the layer of clear coat just to peel it off. And as you can see, pretty quickly did almost the entire roof. There's a section around the shark fin where the clear never touched or never got touched by sun. So that's obviously not going to just flake off. And then for some reason over on that corner, um, the clear is really adhered to the carbon still. So over there I'm having to, there's just a small section, you know, about, I don't know, maybe six inches by two or three inches wide that I'm having to chip a little and then blow it and chip a little and blow it. So <clears throat> eventually it will all come off. Um, as far as the center shark fin part, I'll probably just try to get it to the point where, you know, it's right where the shark fin is <clears throat> and let the body shop go ahead and just feather that with a little bit of sandpaper and then clear right over the top of it again because again, it's gonna get covered by a shark fin and there's really no point in me spending a ton of time trying to get that off. It's probably not gonna come off without some heavy sanding and I don't wanna risk damaging the actual fibers of the carbon around that clear coat. So not gonna, not gonna go too crazy over there, just flake off what I can, let the body shop deal with the rest. Um, and then I'm gonna do a quick wipe down with um, some cleaner. And uh, again, at that point, I'm gonna go around and get the window seals out <clears throat> and then it's gonna go to the body shop to get cleared. And hopefully, like I said, that spot over there just kinda blends in. I'm sure we'll be able to notice it a little bit when I get up close and look for it. Um, but like I said, when I wet it with water, you can't even see that it's there. So um, hoping the same thing happens when we clear coat it. But I'm just going to keep going. Again, the, the um, memory card might get filled up here at some point. Uh, but if it doesn't, you'll see everything that I do. And then uh, at that point, like I said, it's going to the body shop. So we'll be done with it until we get it back.
Thank you.